go with the championship he brought to the seemingly cursed city of Cleveland. 52 years, the drought is over. Time to celebrate a title. And the rings he's won with three different franchises. It's back-to-back -back titles for the Heat. The Cavaliers are NBA champions. This historic 2020 NBA championship belongs to the Los Angeles Lakers. And those ridiculous eight straight trips to the NBA Finals. LeBron James is now the all-time leading scorer in NBA history. LeBron James has shot in history. past Kareem Abdul-Jabbar with a career total destined to land north of 40,000 points. On this scorecard, for what it's worth, I plan to treat that achievement as a championship of its own. But LeBron surely knows by now that not everyone is going to see it the same way. As the chosen one himself put it a few years back, quote, my motivation is this ghost I'm chasing, LeBron said. A ghost, he clarified, that played in Chicago. And the problem there, of course, is that for zillions of staunch Michael Jordan disciples, and believe me, there are zillions, MJ's ghost is uncatchable. Even after LeBron moved past Kareem and his inimitable skyhook, I, too, am still unwilling to go that far. Because undisputed GOAT status, the key word being undisputed, it's not really in play for anyone. Not LeBron, not Kareem or Russell or Wilt, not even Michael. What all-time scoring supremacy does do for LeBron in year 20, it stamps him as the undeniable longevity GOAT, ahead of Kareem who merely happens to rank as the winningest and most feared high school player ever, and the winningest and most feared college player ever, on top of all the NBA plaudits that safely keep Abdul-Jabbar in the three-man elite tier alongside MJ and Braun in the GOAT debate. My read is that there will always be a huge segment of the basketball public that keeps Michael atop its GOAT rankings because of his spotless 6-0 record in the finals and his global icon status after taking this league over from Magic and Larry and taking it into a new stratosphere. If we could set up a fantasy pickup game that made every single hooper ever available for selection, I simply struggle to imagine a scenario where his airness, more often than not, is not the first overall pick. What LeBron can say with no retort is that no one has played better for longer than he has. And he's still going, determined to play into his 40s and keep alive the most enviable of hoop dreams, playing with or against his son Bronny before he retires. LeBron James is the undisputed longevity GOAT having supplanted Captain Kareem as the NBA's foremost symbol of long-lasting greatness. And he did so in the social media era with a 24-7, 365 microscope that magnifies every failure, every flaw, under a glare that in some ways is even more invasive than what MJ had to deal with. Longevity goat is a crown, frankly, that sounds pretty good to me. Is it enough for King James? Only he knows for sure.